Welcome back to RG Geek. So you see I've already downloaded the Garlic OS here. Now I just need to get it ready. This is Belena Etcher here. So we can get this installed because it's much better than the stock salsa. You just add garlic to it. There we go. Since when did RG Geek turn into a cooking show? And here you can see Garlic OS is prepared and ready to be put into the salsa. So see, instead of using an SD card, we have to use a what's called a press to insert this garlic over the stock OS here. Unfortunately, it goes straight over it. You don't need to remove the stock OS to insert garlic into the salsa. And here you can see garlic installed on the stock salsa hardware. Now we let the salsa simmer and this process will take about 25 minutes, which is considerably longer than uh, using Balena Etcher to install garlic on the RG35XX. Now that uh, garlic OS is fully cooked into salsa, we just need to move salsa from pot into the bowl directory. Just like this. And then it'll be ready to be applied to the handheld. Perfect. And here we see the finished salsa ready to be put on the handheld. And you can see you can also charge the salsa here with this uh, wireless charging pad if you need to. So you might want to charge your salsa up before you apply it. Normally in RG Geek, I don't taste my handhelds, but I'll make an exception this time. The guys at uh, RG handhelds will be very happy with me for this. Mm -hmm. Would definitely recommend garlic on salsa with not one more thing. If you want to do game streaming, I recommend a glass of beer with it. Mm. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time on RG Geek.